earthquakes and safety measures. In this chapter, we will understand the phenomenon of earthquake and learn about the safety precautions one must take during an earthquake. Earthquakes generally occur without prior warnings. As a result, people have to take immediate actions to protect themselves from injuries. Earthquakes can cause severe destructions such as the walls and floors of houses and buildings develop crack due to earthquake. Sometimes, roads also develop cracks due to the earthquakes. Here, Raju is thinking about the causes of an earthquake. Now Raju wants to study the causes of the earthquake. As you all know, Earth's surface is divided into continents, which are composed of plates. Over the years, these plates have shifted from their positions. This movement of plates sometimes results in the development of tension along the joints of the plates, which in turn results in earthquake. Volcanic activity is also sometimes responsible for the earthquake. So, we can define earthquake as Earthquake is the sudden shaking or trembling movement of the earth's surface caused by disturbance deep inside the earth's crust. Here you can see a video showing an occurrence of an earthquake. The intensity of earthquake is measured through device called seismometer. The effects of the earthquake are measured on a scale called as Richter scale. Based on the Richter scale, there are various categories of earthquake. Different range values on the scale determine different intensity of the earthquake. If Richter scale is between 2.0 to 2.9, the effects are minor in nature. If the Richter scale is between 3.0 to 3.9, the effects are often felt but rarely cause damage. If Richter scale is between 4.0 to 4.9, it can lead to shaking of the objects. If the Richter scale is between 5.0 to 5.9, it can cause damage to poorly constructed buildings. If the Richter scale is between 6.0 to 6.9, it can cause damage up to 100 miles away. If the Richter scale is between 7.0 to 7.9, it can cause serious damages over large area. If the Richter scale is between 8.0 to 8.9, it causes serious damage over several hundred miles. Over the years, there have been very horrendous impacts due to earthquakes. It has been seen that buildings, bridges and roads have been destroyed as a result of the earthquakes. Do you remember what happened in Bhuj, Gujarat in 2001? The Richter scale measured for that earthquake was between 7.5 to 7.6. As a result, it caused lots of destruction. In hilly areas, the earthquakes have resulted in avalanche and landslides. Earthquakes under the sea have resulted in tsunami. Tsunami is strong wave with speed of 960 km per hour hitting the shore. You can recall the devastating effect as the result of the tsunami that took place in 2004 in the Indian Ocean. Lots of destruction of property and human life took place in the Indian subcontinent. Apart from destruction to the buildings and resources, 
The earthquakes also cause death and injury to animals and humans. Now let us learn about some of the safety precautions one can take during an earthquake. Students, all these points should be taken care of. 1. Move as little as possible. Stay in bed if you are there and try to remain at one place where there is no threat of heavy furniture, light fixtures, mirrors or pictures nearby that could fall. Cover your head with your pillow. 2. We should keep emergency items like first aid box, torch at easily accessible places so that in case of emergency these can be easily used. 3. During an earthquake, move quickly to a nearby safe place. Crouch under a sturdy piece of furniture or against an interior wall or a corner away from windows. 4. We should never use lifts during an earthquake. 5. During an earthquake, it is very advisable to move to the open spaces away from electrical installations. We have learned Causes of the earthquake Seismometer and the Richter scale Impacts of earthquake Safety measures one must take during an earthquake